Hello and welcome to the Peace Security Channel. The title says it all. Today we'll be comparing some security suites based on uh, signatures. This will be a purely detection ratio comparison, so other factors are not going to be taken into account. So this is only to know how good their signatures are. You should not be using this test to decide which product you will use. Now for this test we've got a vast ESET and Komodo. These are the three products I intended to test, but because I'm running MCSoft on my host machine, I thought I'd give you guys the MCSoft detection as well. So let's start off with Avast. Now I've got a virtual machine running Avast here, and I will grab my malware samples. I've got 500 pieces of uh, fresh malware. They're only about eight hours old, less than a day old. So this should be quite interesting. As you can see there are indeed 500 of these. So I will just select the folder and I just want to show you guys that scanning for PUPs is also turned on. So we'll start a folder scan, select the samples folder and Avast should take care of that. The scan from Avast is very fast, so I don't think I'll, I'll have to pause. There we go, we're almost done. And here are the results. I'm going to delete everything. So we'll apply the action. and looks like that is done. Just close out the window. I'm not going to reboot because that is not necessary. And we have got 90 items. That's a big count. So let's calculate what detection ratio that gives us. So that is an 82% detection rate. Not too bad, not too good. Right around average. So now let's head over to Komodo and see how it does. In fact, let's do ESET first. So I've got the same samples over here, the same 500 items, and we will do a right click scan with ESET. And yes, I have turned on detection of PUPs in the options when I installed ESET on this virtual machine. So I will be right back with the scan results. ESET has completed removing all of the malware it found and we're left with 75 items. So that will give us a slightly better detection rate. So that is 85%. Remember, fast managed 82. 85 is event uh, is actually kind of the boundary between average and good. So that's ESET. Keep in mind, ESET is payware, of course, and uh, MCSoft is also payware. Komodo and fast are free, but that doesn't matter. This is just a signature test, so we're not taking into account all the features provided by these products. So. Now we'll move to Komodo and I'll do the test using Komodo Cleaning Essentials which uses the same signatures as their internet security and antivirus. So see you guys at the Komodo machine. Alright, so I've got the same 500 uh, samples over here that I used in the previous two tests and now let's find out what kind of a detection ratio Komodo can manage. Komodo has finished cleaning, so let's go over to the samples and we'll see what it has missed. Now, there are a lot of these uh, CC temp files. Obviously, these have been cleaned. It's probably just uh, so that it knows where to restore them from quarantine. So I'll delete these. So we're left with 47 items. No more, no less. And that should give us a pretty good detection ratio. We had 500 to start with. So 
So that is a detection ratio of 90.6%. Fairly impressive considering this is really new malware. Now last but not least, let's give MCSoft a chance. As I said, that'll be kind of a bonus. Let's find out what MCSoft detects. So for that I've got the same samples over here, so we'll just do a right click scan and I'll be right back. We're almost done here. So MCSoft has completed the scan and removal process. Let's check out what it's missed. Just three items. So that'll give us a detection rate of uh, Should be simple enough. 99.4. We've already seen the same detection rate before. So that's very impressive. Let's put that down. So these are the final results. Uh, as you saw, <laughs> it's quite funny. I didn't plan this out, guys. Uh, look at that. We've got all the scores in ascending order. I had no idea it would be this way, but anyway. Yeah, so a pretty good result. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, if you have any more suggestions for reviews, put them down in the comments below. And I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as you enjoy reviews uh, with editing, because I don't think I'll edit this. I'll just put it as it is. So that's it. Have a nice day, and I'll see you guys next time.